Hey, what is going on, guys? My name is Austin, and that is Shane, and we are two brothers, and today we are reacting to Full Metal Alchemist episode 13. Uh, the last one was a very insightful. Got a lot of lore in that one, and just a lot of just, like, wisdom and knowledge just in general. Like, holy fuck, that was a heavy episode. Yeah, overall, it was one of the best ones yet. Yeah. Because we got really everything. Like, yeah. Everything. Especially, like you said, a lot of lore is great a lot of lore we found out about the teacher we found out why she is the way she is and why she can kind of relate to ed's problems a little bit yeah and the fact now we know why she doesn't need circles and why he doesn't need circles so yeah, i really like the teacher a lot oh, i love the teacher yeah that's one of the so best parts hoping we get more of her me too uh i don't know seeing the backstory was great you got to see the mom got to know about the dad which yeah. is, i think is a big piece yeah a little piece of the puzzle yeah and another highlight is we got another more in depth because we've always talked about like how are how are they so mature? We got a little bit more in depth with that. Like they they've really been through it. Like they oh, yeah. their childhood has been a lot. Yeah, they had to grow up quick. Yeah. So yeah, I mean that definitely fills in some gaps there because now it makes a lot of sense. Yeah. But, I mean, she just threw them on an island for thirty days. Yeah, and like told them to survive. Like, so that's that's pretty extreme. I mean, it's a good way to learn, but my God, yeah, they well, definitely matured yeah. quickly. So yeah, I do really like that. How they explain that a little bit more. But yeah, I mean, I'm just excited to watch the next episode. Yeah. All right. So yeah, let's do it. Oh, we're I just going straight into it. That is. I no. Regardless, I can't accept the decision you made. You're expelled. Oh. But teacher. Ow. Okay. I didn't even know they were still students. Yeah. Because they're already. The trains are still running. Really impressive. Get on one. You idiots! <laughs> you're so busy pouting, you can't see what your expulsion means. You aren't her students anymore, so now you're finally free to speak to Azumi as equals. Oh, okay. Of course, you're too chicken to try. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Al, we haven't done what we came here to do in the first place. I had a feeling Thank she's you. smart. Yeah. So she had, like, right a reason for that. Okay. Don't let her kill you. Yeah. Yeah, wait. Wow, she's sharpening a knife. You think they're going to end up fighting? Teacher? Oh, oh it's hard. What the hell anymore. are you doing coming back oh, here? And you call me teacher. I do not teach scum like you. Get out of my home. Teacher. We came to you because we're trying to find a way to get our bodies back. You must have lost your memory from the shock. We need to get Al's memory back. Whoa. His entire body was taken from him. Just think what he must have seen. Oh, yeah. Memories? Are some of his memories gone? Parts of our bodies for what we saw. Al paid the toll with his entire physical being. He must have seen more of the truth than either of us did. Oh, I never thought about that. If you remember what I saw, then we'll know how to get our bodies back. About the memory of that thing. Uh, that thing. What, is it something bad? No, it's more like awful. It'll drive you insane. Or even leave you brain dead. That doesn't matter. If there's a chance that it can help us, then I want to do it. All right. I have an acquaintance that might know a way to retrieve your memory for you. <laughs> How? But let's eat dinner first. Give me a hand. Okay. She really starting to treat them better. The oh, uh -oh. True. She's able to transmute human souls. Who the hell is this? A lizard dude. All right, he just talked to the camera. Yeah, wait, did he? I thought it looked like. Oh shit! Here we're going back to. One week oh. left until the big transfer, huh? <laughs> yes, sir. It just won't be the same without you. You brought a little. You can consider that my going away gift. Mm -hmm. Well then, if you're in a gift-giving mood, there's something else I'd like. Oh shit! Ooh. Master Sergeant Kane Fury, Warrant Officer Vato Fallman. Second Lieutenant Hyman's Breda. Second Lieutenant Gene Havoc. First Lieutenant Riza Hawkeye. Gather up your things. All five of you are transferring to Central with me. Oh, damn. And no objections. So a little Understood. team. All right. I've got a problem, sir. 
See, I just started dating this girl and I really <laughs> like her. Dump her. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. That sucks. <laughs> oh, all right. It was a scar. It was a scar, yeah. I want more like Mustang story. Mustang and Scar. That's Come what's... on, not again. I'm you really interested in him. If you don't give it a yeah. rest. Everything we asked for last episode, we're like getting right I now. I know, I love it. Master. 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 I'm glad that you're well. I was informed that you've been targeting state alchemists for execution. I know the animosity you feel. A state alchemist is responsible for the burning of our village and the death of our loved ones. Lost your war, but I'll rise again. I'll rise up. I will rise, and I'll use my power to annihilate Edward Elric. Now then, okay. capture him, please, so we can fetch our money. Oh, fuck. it's obvious that I'll only bring more trouble if I stay here. Well, thanks for making this easy, pal. Oh. Holy now, shit! What you do to him? Oh no! I'll give you a moment to pray to God. You should be the one praying, freak! Oh. No, no, wait. Please, I'm sorry. Please don't kill me. Please, I'm begging you to spare my life. I'll do anything. <laughs> Talk shit. Get hit. So you're leaving. Huh. Is he going alone? There you are. I guess. About time. We know your secret. Meet us at the devil's nest if you want to talk. I'm guessing you're. I should think for myself? Yes, and you can start by coming with me. <laughs> I was yeah. waiting for it. So I thought it over for myself. <laughs> and I decided that I should just make you tell me what I want to know. So you want to do this by force? I don't know if you want to fight him. Yeah. What is that going to do? Yeah. Sorry to drop me. Oh. Oh. Do they know? Be a good boy and hold still. <laughs> so what's it like having someone control you from inside? Oh, you fuck. can't stop me from moving, and you're not strong enough to hold this. Why do you go alone? You're right, but all I'm trying to do is slow you down a little. For my turn. <laughs> you are ready. I did not there. expect this. Oh, I'm wonderful. Yeah, I don't really know what's going on. You people aren't human, are you? Good guess. They're chimeras. And they happen to work for me. Oh, the hell are you? Okay. The impossible. The hell? Now, I'm more uncommon than they are. I'm a homunculus. Yeah, see, he has got the markings too. You know what that means, right? I'm an artificially created human. Yeah. Really? No joke. Homunculus? It's a person made from alchemy. But doesn't that book say you're not supposed to try and make people? You're lying! Shit, we're getting some insight into the other sins now, too. Yeah. yeah. Oh, man. Yes, I gotta prove it. Oh! I Can you, like, you not die? Damn. Yeah. Remember, what's her name got stabbed in the head? Yeah. It's so cool. How do you kill them? How, yeah, how do you beat that? It's one time I've died. No way. You get it yet? Nothing is impossible, all right? What do I'm they want with Al? That was great visuals, though. Yeah. That, considering you're just a soul in a suit of armor. Who told you that? People like to talk in the shadow world, and I've got brother. Okay, you just wanted to talk. Really All right. You could get kidnapped. Brother, this guy's a homunculus. Are you serious? Hey, way to ruin it. <laughs> we might be able to get some leads from him on how to get our original bodies back. <laughs> An Ouroboros tattoo. Aren't you observant? I was hoping that I'd only have to deal with a little armored giant. Why don't you just ask your partners whatever you want to know? Partners? Does having animals yeah, being combined with animals make them stronger too? That's what I assume, yeah. They probably all have like special abilities. Yeah. Souls with them as well. You don't say. 
Well, it's kind of a long story, but we don't talk much anymore. I've got Stop him! Wait, what? what? Yo, that's yeah. so... Nope. Sorry. That little hand sword of yours is kind of neat, but it can't even scratch my ultimate shield. How do you beat this guy? Oh. Yo! Holy oh, shit! Guard your head next time! <laughs> oh, that hurt. That... This music's great. Jeez. Oh. We missed a bit. I mean, you can't beat him. Yeah. You dead yet? <laughs> there you go. You're chock full of piss and vinegar! <laughs> But you just can't. Jeez. So, are you ready to tell me your secret now? <laughs> Thanks for toying with me. What? You gave me just enough time to cool off and start thinking clearly. Is my mechanic amazing or what? Even after all this, it's still working. <laughs> <laughs> How long you want to track this out, kid? It'd be so much Wait, easier if you just stay down. Oh. Oh. What? Well, that was bizarre. Good as new. Wait. Oh, is he playing him? What was that for? Oh, I think he learned. Come on again? Try a new one. Oh. Oh, wow. Oh. What the hell did you do to my shield? It's actually pretty simple once you think about it. You may be a homunculus, but you really shouldn't have told me that your body is human, considering that means a third of it is made of carbon. The hardness of carbon varies depending on how the atoms are arranged, so it's obvious that's what your shield is made of. Once I got that figured out, the rest is simple alchemy. Huh. <laughs> Yo, I fucking love it's that. So, that. so much goes into it. <laughs> well, there's one other important thing I noticed. You can't hurt your shield and heal at the same time. Oh, fuck, man. Ed's a beast. I think that it's safe to say that I underestimated you. But you can't really beat him in a fight anyways. But how much longer can you keep this Maybe up you can get tired. Condition? Oh, back up here. here. Um, Sorry to barge in like this. <laughs> Teacher? You damn imbecile! Jeez. Like, <laughs> not to put the broom away? I asked you a question. No, I'm so the sorry. The broom? Thanks for your hospitality. He definitely needed the exercise. Teacher, <laughs> careful. He's a Yes, I know. I could hear the two of you all the way down the hall. <laughs> Give me a break. Don't tell me you're gonna try and start anything, lady. It's no fun fighting a woman. Oh! Oh, God! <laughs> Shit. I thought this guy was gonna be like OP. <laughs> well, now, Still is, but... Just yeah. what the hell are you? You asked what I am. <laughs> That's how it ends? Oh, end? What? That's the most abrupt ending ever. Yeah. What kind of, that was the weirdest ending. Oh my god. Oh. Well, we got our action episode this one. Holy oh, yeah, yeah. shit. He underestimated Ed too. I underestimated Ed too. I did too. But the best part about, like, dude, it's not even like their skills that are the best. It's their brains. They're just geniuses. They're, like, he was working shit out, like... Oh my god. I just love how they use his like intelligence as a weapon. Right. Like that's like he was almost he, more important he, than just, you know, knowing all this like abilities. Yeah. But he still has the skills too to yeah. like back it up. That means. So he was like just waiting, listening, and like Damn. Yeah. And 
and I think she, she's like stronger than him too. So yeah, she'll definitely I think be able to hold her own. Yeah, she's the perfect backup. Yeah. But then what's gonna happen with Al? Like where I don't is know, Al? Right he's getting now? taken away somewhere. Part of me feels like Al's strong enough where he's just like kicking their asses. Or yeah, something. he's somehow. Yeah. I just feel like that's his character. He's always in the background, like just winning, while Ed takes on like the big fights. Right. Fights. But like, how do you beat Creed? I don't know. You can't kill him. But the rest of them are like that too, because they are. They, well, yeah. That's some. We just got some lore dump in this one. Now we know that all the sins are were created from alchemy. Created They're not from even alchemy, like yeah. people. Because yeah, remember, she got the knife through her head. And yeah, she was fine. She should have died. So how do you kill these people? Obviously, yeah. there, there's got to be a way. But he can do the shield thing. I don't think she can do the shield thing. Or, uh, um, uh, who was the other one? Uh, greed. We saw greed, lust. Uh, gluttony. Gluttony. Why can't I think of that word? Yeah, gluttony. Like, I don't really know what his ability is either, really, besides eating people. I think he just eats people. Yeah. Like, that's, that's really it. He's probably really strong or something, too. Yeah. But, yeah, it's really nice. How do you kill him? I feel like it has to do something with the uh, Philosopher's Stone. Yeah, maybe. Because they're looking for it, too. Yeah. Or, I don't even know if they're looking for it. It seems more like they're covering it up. Or, yeah, maybe because that's, like, one of the only ways to defeat them. Defeat them or something? It's that stone, so that's why they're trying to cover it up. I can see that. Yeah. That's probably, it could be what it is. Because if you can bring a body back, what if with the stone, maybe you can take yeah. people away too. Yeah. So maybe it has, it's probably something to do with that. Yeah. I, I, I'm just such a fan of uh, like when, when like uh, the makers of shows like make it seem like it's a lost cause or like yeah. you think your hero's losing or something, but deep down the hero is actually playing the it's enemy the playing. whole time. Yeah. Oh, that not, was not just, I guess not really the playing, but like. He was just learning, listening, and waiting, and yep. he was waiting for his chance to strike, type of thing. And he was just biding his time. He was waiting for the dude to say, agree to say one thing that would help yeah. Ed, and he heard it, and he was yeah. like, "All right, here we go." And then he instantly, he, he's so adaptable. That's the thing. Like, oh yeah, I just love how adaptable these characters are. Like they, they'll sit there and they'll be fighting and sometimes losing. And then technically what they were trying to do the whole time was actually get info. Yeah. And then they just use that at their will and they win. I love that. But I don't even know who won. That was the most abrupt ending ever. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I don't know what's going to happen. I don't either. I don't. I, I mean, I don't think he can take both of them. I think Ed's no. pretty hurt. I don't think Ed yeah. will be able to fight. I just don't want anything to happen to their teacher. I feel bad. Yeah, I'm a little nervous about that. Yeah. And where's our husband? I have a feeling maybe what, what if the other sins show up? Oh, maybe. I feel like if all the sins are together, you know how powerful they must be? Yeah, but I think he said that they don't get along or something. Or yeah, they're not together. He said he's not in touch with them. Yeah, right we're now. in touch with them. That's what it was. But if they are together, oh, like, I don't know really how you beat that. Yeah, and then who? I I guarantee it's one person created all the sins or something. Yep. Like it was definitely like a. It was the dad. <laughs> Imagine <laughs> that'd be that'd be insane if that's the case. I'm sure the dad's gonna be some be a part of something. He's got to be. A part Maybe he'll of like it. help them eventually. Maybe. Or he is like the big bad Could of the be. story. Yeah, I mean that'd be a cool. That's a cool plot, but I feel like I've seen that before. Right. But I'm I'm still cool if that is what the plot is. But and we saw Scar finally. It's been like a couple episodes. Oh shit, Scar, Scar was in this episode. Yeah, it's weird. You know, he's a villain. He's pretty bad, but he's a cool guy. I really want to know more about him because their whole backstory with his people is so interesting. Oh yeah, definitely. And all that, and I don't know. I, I really like him so far. Yeah, I'm sure we'll get to see more stuff with him. True, I think I'm reading too far into it, but he, someone did say something about when he was talking to them. You know, you're trying to get the people who burned down your village. What if, like, I don't know, maybe I'm reading too much into it, but he said burning down specifically. So maybe, what if, uh, what if he learns that uh, Mustang was the one who did it because he's got fire? Oh, that's true. And that could be like a could be rivalry that. story. That'd be I, actually really cool to see that. I doubt it. I might have been reading too much into it. I'm pretty sure he's just going after all of them. Yeah, he's going after all of them. But if he, but he's going after all of them, but then he learns that there was like a specific person. That yeah. Did. That'd be interesting. We and gotta there, see Mustang too. Which yeah. Is nice. That's true. I don't know. He got he formed his squad. Yeah. <laughs> it's smart too. I feel like he did that because he knows that none of those people can be internally uh um like worked over because yeah, none know. of them have any because he thinks that the main the place he's going to the city is corrupt so if he has his own team he knows none of them are corrupt yeah so he, it's I, I see it as like a um, 
oh, what's his name? Commissioner Gordon type shit. Oh, 100%. Where he's got his, his own, own special task force kind yeah, of, you know? so that, like, he knows he can trust them. Yeah. Because, yeah, all the, like people, that. all the people in the city are probably corrupt as hell. Yeah. But, man, that was that was a great episode. I love the action. and The action was I great. Know, I love when everyone they're talking about the alchemy. Yeah, it's me so, too. It's so fun to listen to. Yeah. There's so much behind it. It's not just simple, you know, yeah. stuff. You actually have to, like, listen and hear, like, what they're saying because it's pretty – all of it's, like, very important, every detail. Yeah, it honestly makes it hard for us because I don't even know how to put into words half of this stuff. Yeah, right. Like, the stuff that they say <laughs> is very well thought out and written. It would take – I would have to sit down and, like, think of a way to – discuss yeah the shit that they say because right. it's very very wise and i love it smart i love it they put so much time and effort into this i bet yeah learning every detail about all this 100 percent. it's like because they're the lore in this is insane oh yeah and then the animation and the, the voice acting is always spot oh, yeah. on and the music's been great too music yep yeah definitely a great episode yeah that was the past couple of ones have been really good. some of my favorites yeah the show you can tell the show's like picking up a bit mm-hmm, definitely and we're finally we're i think every character at least main character we kind of already know so that's nice i mean sure we're, we're gonna learn more or get to know some more but it's true there's a lot of characters right now yeah and every character i like mm-hmm. you know definitely yeah but yeah um Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Uh, we sure did. If you did, feel free to leave a like, comment, subscribe. Any of that good stuff keeps you updated with the channel. Feel free to, ch- feel free to check out our Patreon or our uh, Discord. And, yeah, that pretty much sums it up. Again, I hope you guys enjoyed, and we'll uh, catch you in the next video. Have a good one, guys.